And it's second down now. You don't see that a ton, do you? The cornerback coming over to the middle of the field to make a run tackle. That's someone with a ton of confidence to feel like nothing is pressuring him on his side of the field. Sees that the ball's moved to the middle and just sprints over there to help out. He ends up getting the tackle. Well play. Officially nothing on that one. No gain, so they're left with still 10 to go on third down. Right where this set of down started. They need a full 10 here to pick up the first down and move the chains. On third down, it's Prescott. And this will be incomplete. The rush gets him just as he was letting that go. That could have been worse. Instead, it's fourth down. Quite sure that they envisioned a much better start to this game when they practiced all week. But they failed on that third down play. That brings up fourth down, and they'll probably have to punt it away. So still a scoreless game in the first, but they're going to go for this thing on their own side of the field on fourth down. They'll run four with Pollard. And he won't get there. They stop him a few yards short of the line to gain. A surprising move here on the opening drive of the game. And on the opening drive of the afternoon, the defense forces a turnover on downs. staying on schedule. Three to four yards on first down. You're set up very well for the rest of the drive. Second down. Here's Jalen Hurts. He's to the 15. Touchdown. A.J. Brown. 43 yards. And the Eagles will jump on top with the game's first score here this afternoon. So remember now, this was all set up by the stop defensively on fourth down. That's what got them this great field position. And then two plays later, they're already in the end zone. Yeah, partner, funny how it works like that, huh? That's a momentum swing amusement park style. Your defense comes off the field, bouncing, grooving. They're fired up, and it carries over to the other side of the ball. And he's got the PAT, and it makes the score 7-0. Touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. Cavante Turpin now from his end zone. And in hindsight, probably should have taken a knee as he only gets this out to the 16-yard line. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. And last time, went for it on fourth, didn't get it. See if they can pick themselves up off the mat and do that this quarter. Sometimes I have this vision of coaches writing notes to themselves before a game. And sometimes that note says, be aggressive, stay aggressive. Maybe that's what we saw in the last possession. Yeah, they were very aggressive. This time, will it result in points? We'll find out. Deep down there on second down, but on a line up in play. They geared up and took the deep shot down. on second down leads us to third and inches. Here's Prescott. Pass taken in by his big tight end. And he will have a Cowboys first down, at least at first glance, as he'll spot the football just beyond the marker. They find a way to convert on third and inches.
Prescott on play action. Sliding out of the pocket. It's hauled in by Brandon Cooks. And he'll be out of bounds, but able to get it up past the 45. First catch of the game for Cooks. It'll be a first down. And time to give some credit to the big fellas, the offensive line here, because you've got to have good protection on crossing routes because you've got to give the receiver time to work all the way across the field. That time, able to scan the field, spot his receiver moving left to right, and make a good action. Pressure comes, and down he goes. The Eagles get there for the sack. Nolan Smith brings him down on the pass rush. And we all know how talented this guy is. He's calling the signals for him. But even the best in the game, they can struggle against a good, cohesive zone coverage. Can't find a gap in the secondary quick enough, and he ends up taking a sack. They'll run left with Pollard. And he'll be stopped at the 46. Gain of three. And long way to go here on third down for the eighth play of the drive. Comes out on the hit, but they'll say it's incomplete. Defense is locked Yes, indeed. That time, lucky that the arm is going forward in complete pass. Now, remember, they were unsuccessful earlier in this first quarter. Going for it on fourth. They're going to try a second time. And he's brought down. Can't do anything with the football. It's a sack and a turnover on downs. A surprising move to go for it predictably, at least somewhat predictably. It doesn't pay off. And that will force a turnover on downs. On first down, Hurts. Touchdown, Eagles! Devontae Smith, 35 yards. And the Eagles are able to strike quickly to add on to their lead. So that pretty conclusively, I might add, shows you the perils of going for it and not making it on fourth down. One play, touchdown. Yeah, and I've got to put this on the man in charge, the head coach. He made the decision to go for it. To me, when punting was the only decision to make, and it backfired on him in a big way. Elliott Good on the extra point. And now they the score, 15 to 7. Touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. From a yard or two deep, here comes the return. And no alley to be found. The coverage was solid, and he's dropped at the 18. The Dallas offense here set to begin the drive. They've been outplayed early, no question. Down 14 nothing already as they come up first and 10. Kevin Byard up to make the tackle. They'll run the end around. This is Cooks. And it'll be a minimum pickup here as it will take us to the end of the first quarter. 14-0 the score. This is the NFL on EA Sports. The Cowboys on third down. Just one for three thus far. They need just a yard here. It's third and one. Now Prescott. Steps away to his left. So no sack. He gets back to the line of scrimmage, but it will still bring up a fourth down. It's been this negative as he just got back to the line of scrimmage. But when you really analyze it, he took away a big play for the defense, made it an uneventful run because he avoided a sack and didn't lose yardage. now in their own territory a gutsy call they're going to go for this on fourth and a yard they'll try and run for it there he goes left side now he's loose at the 40 inside the 20 touchdown cowboys tony pollard 73 yards and the 
the Cowboys decision to go for it pays off with six points so Dak will bring the Cowboys up to go for the two-point try Prescott they're gonna throw for it and this one incomplete so they went for the two they don't get it so not able to throw it in for two from the two let me ask you as a former DB what changes there around the goal line on a two-point conversion as far as how you're defending? You just make sure you never back up and you never retreat. You, you establish yourself really on the line of scrimmage, put your heels on the goal line at worst. And if they're going to throw the ball, make them throw it over your head because they're going to run out of space because of the pack of the end zone. Never let a guy catch one in front of you. Well, not one you see often there as he fails to keep it between the sidelines, and that is a penalty every time. And going to give this offense better field position. And it's every kickoff nightmare, isn't it? Because you see yourself doing this, and most of the time you don't. It's absolutely a miss hit, and now your team pays the price. Bad field position. <laughs> Hurts and the Eagles come up here first and 10 at the 41-yard line. <laughs> They'll set up to throw. And that's caught inside the 30. Touchdown! Devontae Smith. Two catches, two touchdowns here so far. And the Eagles go up by two touchdowns. Just a sensational start for this offense, Charles. Three drives, three passing touchdowns. Is that like mentioning a perfect game in baseball? We can really do it here in football, buddy. No, I think you can do it here in football. Any perfect game in baseball, that, that's its own category. Yeah, I think you're right about that. Could not imagine a worse start for that secondary. Or let's face it, a better one for this offense. No chances to pass it down the way that it's going. I think we continue to press the ball downfield and hopefully reap the same results. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. And a good return as he'll be stopped just shy of the 30-yard line. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. Right now, Charles, it just feels like they're trying to keep pace. They did score the touchdown last time out, but they still trail by double digits here. We'll see if this offense is once again up to the task. Yeah, and I think that after the last drive, they've gotten pretty revved up, don't you think? Everything they were doing was working pretty well. They go back out there with the same mindset, play the same tempo and the same pace. Still a lot of time left to make something happen in this one. Here's a second and five. Prescott from the gun. From the right side taken in by Gallo. Two yards on the pickup there. And this will wind up being a third and three. Coming up here looking for three yards to pick up the first. Third and short yardage. Prescott. Looking the ball on the field and he's got the man to play. And he will be the Cowboys first down by a couple of yards as they're able to convert here on third and three. First down, Prescott. And this will be well too low for him to bring in. <laughs> he released that awkwardly. It almost looked like a pitcher who gripped his fastball in too hard and let him go late and it bounced in front of the plate. Yeah, one of those fastballs that ends up at 57 feet, not 60 feet, 6 inches. Just a little short with the arm, which is unusual because we saw him in warm-ups. He's got a big, strong arm when he delivers it with confidence. Prescott now on second down. Dancing to his left. Finding room in midfield. And he's able to take it across midfield before going out of bounds. Nine yards, and that leaves him just short, so it'll be third and less than a yard. Inside the 30. And they're able to 
convert on third with a solid gain of 23. Now that's all about making something happen as a quarterback because instead of forcing something on third down, how about him buying some time outside of the pocket, waiting for someone to come open, and when he did, he put it on him for a big play and a first down. Prescott on first down. yard line before it's all said and done. First down now, but that clock rolling. From the red zone now, Prescott. There again is Cooks complete. And now they're inside the 10 as he's brought down at the 9. The Cowboys looking to get going again in a hurry. A second down throw for Prescott. Got his tight end. That's complete. That's Ferguson. And the Cowboys are going to be set up with a first and goal on a pass play that moves them all the way down to the one. That was a route run not just with dexterity, but with intelligence. Found the hole in the zone, made sure the quarterback saw him, and was able to make the sure catch and flip the down marker back to one. This is first and goal and a golden chance to get a score back here before halftime. Pollard looking for a signal, but none forthcoming. They stopped him shy of the goal line. Call it no gain, and it's going to be second and goal. This is a critical sequence here for this offense. Things really haven't gone their way so far. This could be their chance to get back into it, but they've got to find a way to punch this ball in. Play fake. Here's Prescott. And this is caught for a Cowboy touchdown. A one-yard touchdown reception. And the Cowboys get a late score here in the final minute of the first half. Now Mike McCarthy saying, let's go for two. They'll try and throw for it. And he'll get in as they're back within a score now. The lead's down to seven. And I guess that makes up for the earlier missed two-point try here to get him to 14. Yeah, that aggressiveness it reminds me a lot of when basketball first adopted the three-point shot. And people were starting to realize that three for two was really starting to work for them. In this case now, maybe the two for one is coming into play in the NFL. Already at the line, this Philly offense set to go. And with a seven-point lead, they'll likely look to take this to the locker room and not really press the issue. First and ten, it hurts. And he will go down. A Cowboy sack. Got to assume this defense will be charging again here. It's second and 15. The Eagles going to take the first of their timeouts as the clock will stop with 20 seconds to go in the first half. Second down, here's Hurts. That one complete down the field to Smith. And past the 40, before he's out of bounds. 23 yards to pick up there. So in the second quarter, he's already up over 100 yards receiving now. And isn't 100 the magic number for a really good game for a receiver? So he got a chance to really shatter that and have a profound effect on this game. They'll throw on first down with Hurts. And that'll be incomplete with 11 seconds remaining now. That certainly appeared to be a play call where they were just trying to make second down, second and short. I think they thought the coverage was off a little bit more than it was, 
Nice job there pressing up on it and forcing the incompletion. So second down, still 10 yards to go. Ball on the 43. Now Hurts looking to change the play. On second and ten, Hurts. This is Smith to the ground. Now a timeout taken. Perhaps a chance for one more quick play and then another timeout if they hurry. We'll see. Talk about a big first half. Already has the two touchdowns. Adding to his receiving total there and picking up the first down. He's coming off the line so fast. I think he's intimidating the defensive backs with his explosiveness and he's chipping away at their confidence. And now we'll get a late timeout as it comes in the waning moments of quarter number two. <laughs> so even though it's first down, here's the field goal unit on now to try to get three before halftime. From the right hash and call it an even 50 yards. And this is going to wind up left. Well struck, but it's no good. And this will remain a one touchdown game. One of the few things that hasn't gone right in this first half. They had a chance there for late points, but this one winds up off the mark. The Dallas offense here set to begin the drive. And they'll have time for one play. There's two seconds on the clock. So the drive's going to start with Potter. And he will perhaps get back to the line of scrimmage, but that's it. That time has run out on this first half. First half in the books. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Welcome back. Charles and I settled into the booth ready for quarter number three. So the Eagles with the lead, and they're going to get this football first as the third quarter gets underway. The fair catch taken short of the goal line, and they'll begin this third quarter at their own 25. Hurts and the Eagles come up here first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. Starts with a run from Swift. Knights his way forward here, but just three yards on the play. Second down. In the first half, he was held in check on the ground, but despite that lack of production, they still have the lead. Yeah, and they've got to feel fortunate about that. If they could actually get production from their lead horse, that would help open up this offense and widen this margin, too. Mistake for him in the ball game as it's intercepted. And the Cowboys are going to 
take possession as they've got it at the 42-yard line. That is just what this defense was hoping for, an interception on the opening possession of this third quarter. Obviously didn't want to surrender a touchdown and fall even farther behind, and we've gotten to know this team a little bit, haven't we? Couldn't you just see their defensive leaders telling the offensive guys, telling the quarterback, don't worry, we got you to start things off. You take it from there. And they'll manage to break a tackle and get this forward for a couple. It'll be second down. Gonna run again here with Palmer. And he'll be taken down just shy of midfield after a game of about four. And they're gonna hurry back to the line now. He's got his target. That's complete. And he will have a Cowboys first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Pollard gonna try the right side. Thank you. 